Hello, my name is Henry Shuck. I'm the founder and CEO of Zoom Info. And on today's In Your Corner, I'm gonna show you two releases that we just put out to our customers that were widely asked for across our customer base. The first one for marketers is how to identify which intent topics are spiking for your most likely to convert prospects and customers. And then number two for sales reps, we're gonna show you how to get down to the person level when a company visits your website. So historically, Zoom Info has been able to tell you what companies have visited your website. We are now able to tell you who the person in your buying group is who visited your website. Let me show you both of those. So here inside of Zoom Info, I'm able to see a, a pretty obvious one, account-based marketing. When companies are spiking on research on account-based marketing. That's what they're spiking on right before we opened them as an opportunity in Zoom Info or right before we closed one them as an account at Zoom Info. And so I wanna know all the companies right now spiking on account-based marketing because that is the best indicator that they are ready to become an opportunity at Zoom Info and they're going to convert at the highest rate. I'm gonna create a new audience around account-based marketing. Here are all the companies that are spiking within the last month on account-based marketing. For me today, I just wanna look at companies in the United States. I'm gonna use technologies and technographics to make that list even smaller. I'm gonna say, I just wanna look at companies who use Salesforce. I'm gonna choose Salesforce as that technology. And then I don't wanna to talk to all companies. I only wanna to talk to companies that aren't existing customers of mine. So I'm gonna come in here in Salesforce, my CRM's connected, and I'm gonna say, exclude all of my customers. I'm gonna apply those filters here. And now I have an even better list of accounts to target. I'm gonna go next here. I wanna do person level targeting here now as well. So as a marketer, I don't wanna to market to everybody. I don't wanna put ads or television ads or display ads in front of everybody. I only wanna do it to, uh, to contacts that are relevant to my buyer persona. So here I'm gonna say, I'm just looking for chief marketing officers and I'm just looking for chief revenue officers. I'm gonna put those two in and then maybe I'll add another one, vice president of sales and we'll do vice president of marketing. That's a pretty good list. I'm gonna apply those filters here. And now I have a really tight list to start an advertising campaign against. So here I am, I'm a marketer. I'm gonna start advertising in front of these contacts and companies. I'm gonna do a demand gen campaign in front of them. I'm gonna name this brand awareness. And once I start doing that, what's important now is that when somebody within this audience engages with my content, engages with my ad, or comes to my website, I want the relevant seller to go and start prospecting to this account. And so where does that happen? I'm gonna come into Copilot now. If you're a Copilot user, you're familiar with this page, here it ranks all of the accounts I should be engaging with. And so here I see RelyQuest is the number one account I should be engaging with. And I wonder, oh, why? Why would RelyQuest? Well, they're a great fit account. They're not in my CRM. They're a targeted account. They just got funding. And look at here, marketing alert. RelyQuest is being reached out to by Zoom Info marketing campaign. There's been a promotion of someone to VP of sales. We chose vice president of sales in that audience. So we know that they're seeing ads about Zoom Info right now. And then most importantly here, Carla Thomas, the director of revenue operations in my buy committee visited high ranking web pages at Zoom Info. I want to know which pages she interacted with. So I'm going to come in here. I know what she's visited now. And then really what I want to do is I want to start prospecting to Carla. So I click on her name. I can see that this is a good time to reach out. I have her email, her mobile phone number, her LinkedIn profile. I know a little bit about the company here. I know she hasn't engaged with us before. So this is a net new opportunity. I'm gonna hit email here. The AI emailer is gonna draft me an email to follow up with Carla on. I'm gonna choose a different topic that she actively researched sales intelligence. I know that she visited our enterprise solutions page. So I'm in additional context, I'm gonna say, I'd love to talk to you about enterprise solutions at Zoom Info. And then I'm gonna ask the AI to draft that again. And here I go, I've got the perfect draft email here. I can edit it, I can get it out to Carla. I know she was on our webpage. So the power here is twofold. Number one, marketing is now able to know exactly the intent topics that companies are spiking on before you open an opportunity with them. And then we could go to find an audience of companies that look just like those. And then second, 
We are now able to tell you the exact person in your buying committee that's engaging with your content that is on your website so that when you reach out to a company, you can reach out to the specific individual who's been engaging with your website, engaging with your content. Our customers have been asking for these features for the last couple of years. We're so excited to release it to them. If you're not using Copilot, reach out to your account manager, reach out to us at zoominfo.com backslash Copilot. We'd love to show you this next generation technology. Thank you.